think that what's nice about augmented reality or virtual reality is that you can be whoever you want to be. And I can understand why some people may feel that that creates a, this false sense of reality. But a lot of times people don't feel comfortable in their own skin, and so we can allow them to creatively express whoever they want to be in these new mediums. I think that's really powerful and beautiful. Hi, my name is Sofia Dominguez, and I'm the CEO and co-founder of SURF. SURF is the first search engine for augmented reality and virtual reality. We help people find the best augmented reality and virtual reality based content and deliver it to them where they already are. I was working at Rothenberg Ventures as an entrepreneur in residence, and I got to work with about 20 different AR, VR companies. During my time there, I noticed how much content was being created, um, but there was no easy way for people to find it. And I looked at the history of search engines and realized search engines evolve out of every new content type, and so AR and VR would be no different. The easiest way to think about augmented reality and virtual reality is it's just a new type of screen. So today we're limited to these rectangles on our phones, on our computers, um, but augmented reality and virtual reality breaks us out of that and allows us to interact with technology and digital content the same way that we interact with our real world environment. So if the internet were confined right now to a rectangular screen, uh, we're limited to this idea that we can only connect with people through a screen. And I think with augmented reality and virtual reality, you're allowed to just interact with people or these digital assets that are all around you, and you're no longer confined into this rectangle. There was this one YouTube video that some artists made in which it depicted a future world in which there were no controls around walking down the street and just being bombarded with digital assets and billboards everywhere. I do think lots of laws and rules are going to have to be established. And something that is often not talked about is this idea that if you're wearing a device, likely the ads will be tailored to you. Um, so what you see may not necessarily be what your friend sees. I think that when we think about new technology, it always comes off as something scary. Um, but the reality is that technology helps us more than hurts us. And so augmented reality and virtual reality are designed to improve our lives. And again, both technologies will be extremely useful for things like education, automation, and all sorts of communication.